Hey guys, it's me Ruchi and welcome to my channel. I am exploring Goa along with my five friends. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. While riding on the local roads of Goa, you can see a couple of houses which are surrounded by numerous trees. This is a local church. It is very beautiful to look around. The whole combination of the bright sunny day with waving lush green coconut trees creates magic. After a ride of 45 minutes from our stay, we reached the Chapora Fort. This becomes the main tourist attraction in Goa after the movie Dil Chata Hai, in which there was a scene where the lead heroes visit this fort and gets a picture clicked of themselves. Once you reach the top of the fort, you will not be able to find any shops there. So if you want to buy some water or any other stuff for yourself, you can take before going up. This is the main entrance of the fort. No, I don't want no rest. Echoing around these The beauty of blue water, the plateaus and my friend's company was so overpowering that it does not bother being so hot at all. It is a pleasant place to wander. We'll go through the wastelands through the highways to my shadow through the sun rays. Trying to recreate the Dil Chata Hai moment. Just climbing a little bit from the parking area, there is a small market from where you can get your hands on some souvenirs. From Thapura Fort, our next destination was a church situated in Panjim that took us about 1.5 hours to reach here. This is the first look of the church. While visiting this church, make sure you are wearing long clothes. This is the tip for everyone, or else you'll be made to sit at the back seat and will not be able to go in the front. I'm walking alone, the streets are empty. The only thing I can see is my own silhouette. On the same day at night, we decided to go out for dinner. At night also, the city looks equally amazing. The streets flourished with people, the roads get jam-packed. A maximum number of people were going to Tito's, which is also a major attraction of Goa's nightlife, which is almost always crowded. So we eventually came to a decision to go to a beachside restaurant at Baga Beach and have our dinner. We reached there at 11.30 and stayed till 4 a.m. in the morning. But I must say, it is very safe till this late also. The Goa police is always patrolling around and is there for you in case you need any help. That's all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel, share this video with your friends and family and do hit the bell button. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.